cleaning started here in our community in about 2017. The Casclay Food Commission was looking at a blueprint of how we could adopt a gleaning network here in our community. Gleaning is actually an ancient practice. It is, dates back to biblical times, if not before. In modern times, we think of it as going out, working with farmers, collecting any excess produce they may have, whether it be because they have a bumper crop or overplanted something or grew an extra row to donate. They allow us to come in, pick some of that produce, and then take it to food pantries and meal sites so that all of our neighbors have access to fresh produce. I think there's many different layers to it. So not only is it getting food to the people that need it, but it's also connecting your community with um, people that are growing your food. In a lot of ways, it's just kind of bringing people from the city out. They're um, awfully busy with things going on and bringing them out into the country, showing them what the country life is like is one of my favorite things since that's what I grew up with but also kind of giving them a perspective into the behind the scenes of where the food's coming from, how it's getting to where it needs to be. 27% of the food uh, produced in the country never makes it to the dinner table. And so by being able to go out and help get some of this produce out of the field, it really helps to lessen that waste and help make sure more food that we're producing is getting to neighbors' tables. Gleaning is important because it really allows more fresh produce into our local food system. All of our neighbors don't have access to that fresh, healthy produce that we can go buy at the grocery store. And so just a great way to ensure that our pantries have access to that fresh food as well. So this gleaning program that the Cast Bay Food Partners has introduced um, has found a great partner in the Great Plains Food Bank. And they've really made it easy for us as producers to get involved with the program and make it easy for us to um, get a group of volunteers out to our farms to either save that produce was either going to go to waste um, or if we just wanted to grow a little bit extra because we see the need, um, they make it easy for us to um, get it to where it's, where it's most needed. We welcome people of all ages and backgrounds to help us glean and the number of volunteers we need really just depends on what our glean is. When we have gleaning opportunities, we'll email our volunteer listserv and then we also post those opportunities on Facebook, which you can find our Facebook page at facebook.com slash glean North Dakota.